give a shout out to DME TV. They the best professional and slick. <laughs> Way too much flex, flex, not enough hustle. hustle. Things are working out. Yeah. I got it off the muscle. Yeah. Just a year ago, I was knee deep in the struggle. Yeah. But now they looking cause they never know. Follow me at Cree the Model. That is Cree C R E the Model. Instagram and Facebook. I also have a platform showcasing indie music talent on Cree Speaks Media. It's Cree Speaks Media. Okay. How long you been modeling? I've been modeling since July 2015, I believe. I'm sorry, January 2015. It's really been like two or three years. Okay. I mean, what got you into modeling? Um, I started to become more confident in myself, and I was passionate about seeing people who look like me on screen. I want to be the inspiration for younger, dark-skinned girls who are told that they're not beautiful because I had to step into myself. Uh, I think I stepped into myself maybe around, a little bit around high school, but then I grew up, and then here I am now, what I'm like. Black and beautiful, Killing baby. Ah. <laughs> hey. That's what's up, that's what's Black up. Black girl magic, yeah. Hey. So can I give, let's say, an uh, uh, up and coming young black female that's one of model, that one of model, can I give her like one or two things that they would need, you know, to, to succeed? Um, you need the gift of discernment, knowing who, trying to figure out who you should be working with, intuitively feeling like something is wrong and following that gut. If you feel like somebody's not safe to work with, don't work with them. Look at their body of work and see that they're, if they have a variety versus this, this, um, this very limited category, which is just women exposing their bodies, you know? Right, right. So, um, yeah, you need the gift of discernment, and you have to have confidence. You have to believe in yourself. If you don't believe in yourself, nobody else is going to believe in you. And you have to be able to hype yourself up, even when you feel like you're at your worst. You know, I have, I grew my locks for four years. When I first had my locks, I felt ugly. But I had to push myself <laughs> and, and tell myself, you're beautiful every day. And here I am now. If I let it down now, I'm going to be showing out. Okay. <laughs> so what, what do you have coming up this year? for our shows Ooh, anything um, big I am I am doing a whole lot right now okay. which is kind of outside of modeling um, okay. I do have music on the way I rap okay. I have music on the way I pl do plan to do videos with that I'm also um, like I said I just started Chris Speaks Media I'm blogging about the local music events indie, um, independent artists so I'm hoping to throw events or just become a part of some where I'm just you know covering the music and yeah. I, because I'm all about supporting your local people you know right. so I agree yeah. with you I mean you come check us out DME TV do the same thing you know we support the local artists shoot videos interviews whatever you need we do, we do all I that I so. interviews too you yeah, know? So. yeah we have some of, some of that coming on the way too okay yeah. I'll come up to I check you out that's what's just up just follow Cree Speaks Media and Cree the Model and Cause they never know what's in the duffel Way too much flex, flex. not enough hustle. hustle Things are working out, yeah. I got it off the muscle uh -huh. Just a year ago, I was knee deep in the struggle yeah. But now they looking cause they never know what's in the duffel